So I'm starting this off by showing my front door. Um, I got like a sticker from Amazon and put it up here because I don't like people being able to like just completely see in my door. Um, I'm going to try to link everything down below. I know I say that, but this time I really am. If you see my YouTube, other videos, you saw that you saw this area before that mirror I have for a while these beads i got these black ones from home goods the white one from amazon like a while ago um this entryway table i actually made myself this vase was a diy and these eucalyptus i got from hobby lobby nobody told me hobby lobby be hitting for stuff like this so we're gonna go on to another room this is what's going to be what is going to be my office my little shred pile but this lovely beautiful thing right here is a desk i got from cb2 uh, i'm just showing y'all I, I know i need a real office chair but i'm showing y'all that it doesn't close all the way um so they are supposed to send me a replacement it's been a couple of months it keep getting pushed back so these curtains i got from i think west am I wanted to share curtains in my office because I want it to be bright and in the daytime, as you can see, it's like really bright and I love it. So that was the purpose of sheer curtains. Um, this is the only place I want sheer curtains. So this is like the one of the guest bathrooms. Um, I shown, I'm showing this rug. So I like to leave the price tags on so y'all can see how much I paid for. This rug was $14.99 from Home Goods. Um, but this is not the true price. No, I didn't steal. It wasn't, it didn't have a tag and we couldn't find another one. So the guy that worked there just put $14.99, leaving the store. I realized I saw another one. It was $29.99. Anyways, this is the film that was on my front door. I was showing y'all I was going to put it on my bathroom door. And what I just showed was like a little smell good thing I have in there because I keep the door closed. So, yeah. I'm turning off these lights because, girl, light bill. Please don't ask me why this stand still look like this at the bottom. Uh, Y'all, I be busy. I'm going to finish it today. Today, I took a day off from work, but yeah if you haven't seen my previous videos i did make this please check out my previous videos and my youtube shorts i did make this stand it is um a rest restoration hardware dupe um so i'm just showing what's on there those books are coffee table books that crystal is from home goods this thing is heavy um got my goods in there i'm trying to see where the tag and i was like oh no girl but this is 16.99 it's from home goods and that's a coffee table book that i've been had um i'll link everything from amazon and if you didn't know that is sage and palo santo this right here is a rare find um please don't ask me what it's supposed to be but i got this from an antique shop and originally i was going to spray paint it but after I cleaned it, um, I really like how this looks. So I just kept it like this. And yeah, I put some dried um, lavender that I already had. And it just stuck it in there. So I really like this. And yeah, just put it on my stand. I think it was like $56. That top came with it. So yeah, a stopper or whatever. These are crystals, more crystals. I've collected stuff with those. That is from like a... Um, crack it yourself geoid i got from amazon that one right there won't crack for nothing so i'll leave it below but i don't know anywho so to the kitchen to the kitchen so everything y'all pretty saw in here i don't think i've showed y'all both of these i think i showed y'all that small one and not this big one um if you didn't know i'm a got an obsession for cutting boards and i got that big one i think from home goods don't pay attention to like my stove i was getting ready to cook so this beauty beauty here i'm just closing my um little cabinet door because it was a mess in there but i got this beauty from cb2 i love it love it love it it's actually bigger somebody was at my door my ring doorbell was letting me know and i'm like oh, girl who this um but anyways 
got this from CB2. Coffee table book I've been had. This candle, home goods. Um, I love the sand and fall goji berry. This is the holiday berry, and it smells just the same. I think they just put holiday berry because of the holidays. I'm like, okay, girl, whatever. Anywho, back to this. So this is what I'm showing you right now. It's a mixture. That is what I got from West Am. I don't recommend. It was super expensive for no reason. These babies is what I got from Hobby Lobby. When I say I'm real salty that nobody told me, anywho, this is my dining room. I'm showing y'all like my garbage is right here. I need to find another spot, but because it's right next to my table. Don't pay attention to this. This is my early Christmas gift. My aunt, my godson sent me. Um, I had just recently opened it and it was just still there on my table. So yeah, uh, I'm trying to, I'm actually talking and end up deleting the video. But anywho, I'm from Florida. I'm a gator girl, you know. <laughs> Anyways, this table comes from Ashley, Ashley's home furniture. I've had it for a while. I just restained it. I'm showing y'all, you can see the difference. This is what it did look like. This is the top that I actually restained or whatever. These chairs, I do have a YouTube short, so you've probably seen it. I got these chairs from Value City. Love them. If you order them, sometimes they're in stock. Sometimes they say in 2022. So, yeah. Love it. Um, And, yeah. This rug, I am going to insert a clip of what this rug looked like before I put it here. Um, Got it from Wayfair. And if you do order a rug, I'm showing you the rug pad from online places. Do get a rug pad because, because it thickens the rug. And, yeah. That rug pad is very thick, and you want to have your rug pad smaller than the rug. Like, I'm showing y'all where the rug pad ends, just so y'all can see. This bowl, baby. I'm in love with this bowl. Got it from Pottery Barn. I didn't know it was this freaking big. Um, I actually ordered this first, and then I saw one from CB2, and I was like, okay, the one when the one from Pottery Barn comes, I'll just send it back. I got the box and I was like, why they always put the small stuff in big boxes? When I opened the box, I, was, I literally was like, oh, I love it. And I automatically knew I was going to put it here. Um, it's empty right now. I do want to get some green moss. I haven't found any green moss that I like. So, yeah. Um, yeah, some green moss is going to go up in that baby. Just love it. So like the video, please, and subscribe if you're not a subscriber. So here we're going to, I'm just going to show you the um, rug before I put it under my table. So it does look a little darker um, because I actually recorded this at night and it was pretty dark in my house. Anyways, but I just wanted to show you that basically the whole rug Um if you do get rugs from online, you might have to put something on the ends. Uh, I don't know if y'all saw my book. I did put a book on the ends um, because one of them was like extra curled up. But yeah, I'm just taking a little video so y'all can see the detail, the pattern. Um, you see how it's curled up a little bit? So yeah, and it eventually flattened. So now we're going to the living room. I was laying on my couch and my couch covers are in the washer. Anywho, these are some curtains. I don't think y'all saw these curtains. Um, I got these from West M. I might change them to a darker color. Y'all saw all this stuff, but y'all didn't see this painting. I think I did a YouTube shorts. Um, I think I am going to go over it because I wanted more texture, but it is a texture painting. I got these lights. Um, don't pay attention to my cords. I wasn't going to record this, but I was like, oh, they didn't see my new TV. My 65-inch. I have to... Get it, uh, what you call it? Put on a wall, but them people, they want $300. Anywho, this is my Christmas decoration, the only decoration that's going up this year. But I was trying to show y'all that the lights do turn on and off. I mean, you can dim them and make a lighter, but my remote was tripping. I think I need to replace the batteries. This is the black one that I did. I want to add more texture to this one as well, but I still love it. Um, I'm trying to show y'all how it looks and turn it on the light so y'all saw these two i got this eucalyptus from hobby lobby as well it smells so good and it's cheap 
Mr. Body right here. I'm pretty sure y'all saw this all across YouTube. Um, everybody and their mama got one. But I've been wanting one. I finally found one at Home 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 Goods. I keep ready to say Hobby Lobby. And this was $69.99. Um, I know some people said they got for $59.99. But yeah, mine was $69.99. It is what it is. These boxes... Um, they're actually patio furniture that I am going to put out here for my fire pit, but I'm waiting for my other set of cushions. I got these from Pottery Barn. My other set of cushions was supposed to come. They haven't came yet. So, guys, this is the end of the video. Um, this is a vase. I did a DIY. This might be my next video. Um, yeah, so these are other DIYs I did that's sitting out here. This is my backyard. But anywho, thank you guys for watching. If you're not a part of the Kiki fam, please subscribe. You know, tell a friend to bring a friend so we can all be your friends.